Have we just made the world's smallest ensuite? To get two ensuites in this space, one for this bedroom and one for the bedroom next door, we've had to really use our noggins to make this space work. And this isn't an ensuite without a toilet. This is a full blown, full work and toilet, not on a macerator with a sink and separate shower. The first thing is where do you put the toilet? Well, as long as you can get it in a position where it functions really well and you can actually sit on the thing, that's the first thing to think about. The second thing is the shower space. We think these quadrant showers work really well in these really tight spaces. And we've been fortunate enough to find a supplier that will give us a 700 by 700 millimeter quadrant, which sits really nicely in the space where the door will open. And the door always has to open on the outside so you can actually get into the toilet without having to fiddle around and working around and dancing with the door.